We're on Rue Cardinale, which is one of my favorite streets in Paris. It doesn't look like much, but to people like me, to writers and people who love and collect books, uh, it's one of the most important streets in Paris because here on the corner used to be the press called the Black Sun Press, which was run by Harry uh, Crosby and his wife Caress. And they published some of the most beautiful books ever to come out of the expatriate uh, culture. They published D.H. Lawrence, they published James Joyce, they published Marcel Proust. They didn't care if they made money, they did it for the love of it. It came out of that great outpouring of creativity uh, that characterises what the French call uh, les années folles, the mad years, but we call the Paris that sizzled. And I hope you'll join me here to take a look at these and other little corners uh, of that Paris that was so important and creative to all of us. This is Place Fustenberg. Uh, it's one of the central points of uh, Paris's sixth arrondissement. In the 1920s and 1930s, on any given day, you could expect to meet here Gertrude Stein and Alice B. Toklas, Pablo Picasso, Scott and Zelda Fitzgerald, Ernest Hemingway. Why here? Why not any other square in Paris? Because there's something special about this place and this area that's crucial to any understanding of Paris uh, in the 1920s.